What's up, MIS team? Hope everybody's doing well today. We are T minus one day until our restart. I am pumped. We are working super hard to make sure everything is ready and we are looking good. Um, so my address today is focusing entirely on safety. Now we prioritize the help and safety of our staff, clients, and partners. Uh, we put it first above all. So I wanted to take a moment to talk about all the protocols that we are gonna have in place and what we're doing. First, uh, we are currently recertifying all of our instructors uh, with our online COVID health and safety training. We're doing this in waves. So for those of you that are teaching first this weekend, you've probably already been contacted and sent the link and given the instructions. So rest assured your turn will come if it hasn't already. Number two, we are still operating under non-contact protocols. So what that means is that for Young swimmers, beginner swimmers, or kids that we don't know their level, uh, a swim test has to be done, which is two laps of the pool. So instructors, remember to stay close with your swim aid in the event that they have trouble with it. If they pass the test easily, parents don't have to come in. If they have difficulty or they can't swim at all, obviously use your judgment, um, but then the parents do have to assist with the lessons. I'm gonna be sharing the link to our free non-contact training. Um, if you, in case you want a refresher, it's got some great tips on how to deal with the most common non-contact issues for beginners, like you know, parents not knowing what to do, kids not listening, et cetera, et cetera. Um, PPEs, so personal protective equipment. Uh, you guys should still have all of your gear. If you do need more gear, uh, either drop a message into the comments below um, or message Alon and Jake, the staff managers now, and we'll arrange to have PPEs delivered to you. Uh, reminder for our equipment. Uh, so instructors have to disinfect equipment and common surfaces. Now for equipment, it's easy. When you show up at the pool, put everything into the pool. Make sure you dunk it under the water so it all touches the chlorine and that's considered a disinfecting of the equipment. Leave it in until your shift is done and then take it all out. Now remember, on your breaks, after your shift, if you have no-shows, uh, instructors have to disinfect common surfaces of the pool area. So we're talking about the door handles, chairs, railings, even the edges of the pool if you feel it's necessary, but you guys have to do this uh, whenever you have the opportunity to do so. Now remember, uh, safety policies, so if clients have questions about the safety policies, they can be found on our website in the policies section as well, it's linked in their registration emails, which they should all be getting now. Instructors, if you guys have questions, go to the message board. Right at the top of the message board, there's a document, it's uh, spring 2021 safety policies or something like that. But there it links are general policies which apply to all classes as well as the specific policies which apply to every pool. Remember to review this carefully uh, for the locations you're working at so you can communicate this to your clients in your pre-session phone call and so that you know what to expect when you show up for your lessons. Aside from that, remember, just like we do at the beginning of every session, we always have to contact or we always have to reach our clients to confirm their details. Start day, time, location, as well as those super important uh, COVID policies, as well as the non-contact and swim test protocols. That's pretty much it, everybody. So if you have any questions about the policies, again, drop a comment uh, in the comments below uh, or message your staff manager, reach out to everyone. I mean, we are looking really, really good for this restart. Uh, I'm pumped. I am very confident that we are going to, again, do so uh, very well, very effectively. So have fun with it. I'm pumped that you guys are getting back into the pool and have a great day, everybody.